Just last week, we introduced you to Eugenie Bouchard, a Canadian tennis player to watch. Now she's stunned the tennis world, becoming the first Canadian to make it to a Grand Slam semifinal in 30 years. Peter Armstrong has her incredible story. Eugenie Bouchard to serve. On center court, facing a former world number one in the quarterfinals of a Grand Slam, it's hard to overstate just how big a moment this was for Eugenie Bouchard. Beautifully done by the Canadian. The Montreal teenager likes the pressure, enjoys the spotlight. I enjoy the big stage. I mean, I for sure love a big crowd and the atmosphere. By making it to the semi-final, Bouchard has earned at least $540,000 in prize money. That is more prize money than she's made in the rest of her career combined. Many congratulations. It's your first Grand Slam semi-final. Along with the wins, Bouchard now has to get used to these post-game interviews and the blurry line between athlete and celebrity. You're getting a lot of fans here. A lot of them are male, and they want to know if you could date anyone in the world of sport, of movies, I'm sorry, they asked me to say this, who would you date? Um, <laughs> Justin Bieber? Okay, Justin. As she rises to meet the moment, the sports world is greeting her with open arms. Sports Illustrated calling her the next big star. Tennis great Billie Jean King took to Twitter to congratulate the young Canadian. There you go. Very enthusiastic. And like any bona fide star, Bouchard has a group of diehards in the stands, the Genie Army, a group of Australian superfans. We got all these shirts made with, all, with their names spelled out and the maple leaves and, you know, and we started coming up with chants. They're really great. They come up with all these songs and stuff. It's fun. And I got a, I got a wombat today, so... Uh... <laughs> so now on to the semifinals tomorrow night. She'll have to discard the accolades and forget the hype Jeannie Bouchard wouldn't have it any other way. Peter Armstrong, CBC News, Toronto.